What's up Team Strony Gamer fam? It is John here with you guys today and I have an exciting little video for you all. It's not a long one, but it is a fun one. We are going to be opening some Pokemon packs today. Uh, I jumped on to Pokemon TCG Live. I haven't been on in a while, um, but it is exciting to come on and see that there's some packs sitting there waiting to be opened. Uh, as well as all these, I think these are basically like promo cards. Uh, so a bunch of promo cards and then several packs to open, which is always lots of fun to do. Uh, I have been taking a look at some of the new sets that have been releasing. Uh, obviously, I'm always going to be an OG Pokemon fan at heart. Uh, definitely Watsy era. Not much past that did I really uh, know what was going on. Uh, I did come back into uh, the collecting scene for Pokemon probably around uh, near the end of X and Y. Uh, and then definitely well into Sun and Moon, and then sort of fell off when Sun and Moon was finishing. Yeah, Birdie, we know you're here too, Birdie. Uh, and so basically, uh, we're just going to open up some packs, take a look, see what we get. I have been sort of looking in the deck builder, trying to figure out the best way to spend uh, a bunch of these gems and crystals that I have. Um, so yeah, that's basically what we're going to be doing. Uh, we are opening the newest set here of the Pokemon TCG. Uh, so that's lots of fun. It's cool to see some of these new cards. Yeah, so basically opening uh, six packs of the Scarlet and Violet Twilight Masquerade. Uh, so this is the newest set that has dropped from Pokemon. Um, the new big thing right now is Ace Spec cards, which I was not around for when they came out before. Uh, but I guess Ace Spec is sort of a, a shout back. Uh, I believe it was Diamond and Pearl. Some of the Diamond and Pearl sets. I could be wrong. Let me know in the comments if I am. Uh, I'm always happy to learn that I'm wrong. Uh, but basically, a spec is the new big thing in the cards. Uh, and so it's like a special treatment. Uh, the card itself has a lot more of a pink and purple hue to it. Um, I believe there's a limit to how many of them you can have in your deck. Uh, but basically, oh wow, look at that full art. Blissey, that is sick. Nice, that is a sick card. Uh, yeah, so I've been looking to see also like how many cards some of these full arts cost. Uh, like these cards, how many crystals and stuff they cost to get them into your deck. And I was pretty surprised to see like some of them as low as like 600. Uh, so you could, you know, bling out your deck for pretty cheap. Like the Charizard deck I'm playing, if I wanted to run another Charizard in it, it's only 600 uh, of the in-game currency. So that's pretty sweet. Uh, but as for gaming in real life, guys, it's been a while since I've had some time to play anything. Uh, but basically, I do want to get down and play some more Lorcana. Uh, our local game store has been officially licensed as a Lorcana store, so that's pretty exciting. And they do run Pokemon Trading Days every Saturday for kids. Uh, so I thought about bringing the kids to that because they can learn more about trading, enjoy some free pizza, and just have an all-around good time. So shout out to the local game store for doing stuff like that. That's really cool to see. Uh, but anyways, guys, that's going to be everything for me today. As always, make sure you comment, share, like, subscribe, and we'll catch you in the next video.